Hi guys, it is a cool, foggy, 52 degree day here in August. Sunday morning, August 3rd, 2014, before I do my doomsday sermon. I am going to bring you a good news, feel good, eco-Nazi video. People who act like your old doomsday tourist, Tambone never shares good news. Here is what brings joy to an eco-Nazi's heart. A former California real estate agent's heart. And where I am is standing on Manchester Beach on the Mendocino, California coast. Mendocino County California at Manchester Beach on this foggy Sunday morning having a delicious cup of coffee and what we're looking at here guys are two houses from a former subdivision that this this whole stretch of Manchester Beach this absolutely gorgeous beach which you can't see because of the fog was slated to be a subdivision uh, years back and they actually these millionaires actually came in here and started building their little second homes I guess and uh, I'm not sure if this is one or two houses it looks like maybe these two millionaire buddies uh, shared the same compound this is their swimming pool they uh, I already had the swimming pool dug and this is what it looks like today is a flower garden look at these beautiful flowers blooming in the middle of these millionaires swimming pools so this guys I want you to look at this video this is a picture of agenda 21 in action. If you've ever heard the term Agenda 21 when Alex Jones and all of those right-wing uh, fear-mongering crackpot conspiracy theorists whatever you want to call them are talking about Agenda 21. This is what they're talking about. This is a piece of this gorgeous piece of private real estate private real estate held by no doubt hard-working Americans so they could build their second homes on the beach being taken over by the government in this case the California Coastal Commission the bane of the California Association of Realtors, which for all I know, I'm still a member of, although I haven't paid dues in a few years. And so the California Coastal Commission came in here and somehow, even after these houses were built and the swimming pool was in, came in here and kicked these little millionaires out on their ass and opened up this gorgeous beach to the public so this is now public lands which probably means that Farrakh Obama wants to move a uh, that Farrakh wants to move a fracking well into here I guess this is the garage where they used to park their gas sucking cars this is what and I like this this the, the graffiti this isn't where i parked yeah this is where these little millionaires parked this was probably the laundry room where are you day one i came home day two house got destroyed day three wife came home Yep, day one I came home, day two my house was destroyed by the 
California Coastal Commission, the Agenda 21 Masters of, at the California Coastal Commission. And now the only thing living here is a flock of, I guess, barn swallows. So uh, the millionaires are gone and the barn swallows have returned. This is obviously the kitchen here. Okay. And we have the normal teenage boy graffiti. Okay, let's go out onto the I don't know if this was the master bedroom or the porch. Well, here is the fireplace. Here's the fireplace. And so, this is the view that these millionaires used to enjoy from their, uh, I guess from their living room. Let me get a picture of your old doomsday tourist eco-Nazi former California real estate agent here celebrating Agenda 21. Bring on Agenda 21. And when you hear this term rewilding, this is another one that uh, the Alex Jones Kool-Aid drinking gang wants to talk about. It's a close cousin of Agenda 21. It's, it's just one of the chapters in rewilding this is what they're talking about. This is a rewilding project, although I don't think they're introducing any species into here, but it's all part of uh, basically letting Mother Nature rewild. And you can see how Mother Nature is rewilding the inside of this house. Absolutely love it guys. I want you to take a picture, take a look at the future of this planet once people are gone. Life after people. And uh, here is the fireplace in this lovely home. <clears throat> Oh yeah, those poor little millionaires, I guess, had to find a place, another place, to build their little second home. There's the bathtub, full of water, full of water. I can't read what the graffiti says. Something over a dollar sign. Oh, dinero. Misspelled. Dinero. Washing money. That is washing money. Yep. And here is life after people. I just, I, you, you don't know. I mean, this just, there's the view out the bedroom window looking back at the Mendocino Hills. Yep, Agenda 21 in action. And from here on, all the way for miles and don't think that Agenda 21 has been stopped just uh, in the past year Barack Obama has signed into law a, a new national monument imagine that a national monument locking up I don't know how many hundreds of acres from the real estate developers whether he's going to ever start fracking here on this earthquake uh, fault line. I don't know. He and Jerry Brown. But that is the view out this window. That if the poor little millionaire who owned this house wants to enjoy, he's going to have to 
do like the rest of us and go camping. And with that, I'm going to go down and join the flock of seagulls and find another way back to my tent. And uh, you can't see this through the fog. This is Irish Beach up here. Irish, uh, Irish Beach is one that had got away from Agenda 21. I ought to go do a rant about Irish Beach right here, less than a mile from here. That subdivision that did not get torn down by Agenda 21, so nobody can visit there except the millionaires with their second homes there. So, again, this is your old doomsday tourist former California real estate agent saying bring on Agenda 21. Bring it on. We got a planet to save. Let's get her done. Get her done with Agenda 21. This is your old eco-Nazi saying I need to get ready for my doomsday sermon for this one. Bye guys.